we just went and rented a car for one day so I can spend the morning with my little Gracie girl. It's a Toyota 4Runner. I'm used to driving a Volkswagen Beetle. Don't know how this is gonna go. I'm gonna do my best. This isn't a joke. I wasn't making it up, Mom. Isn't this car huge? Where's the chocolate milk? I drank it. Already? Oh, yes, okay. it was a little container for elementary schoolers. I can't drive this. Look at my legs compared to this whole entire vehicle. Did you have a hard time getting up in it? Yes. Yeah. I reached for your hand and you didn't give it to I me. grabbed the camera to make fun of you. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Where's that Gracie? Where's the prettiest girl? Where's that, yeah. that Grammy? Oh, yes, yes, yes. You want to go for a walk at celebration? Go get some coffees? You want to go get a coffee? Yeah, let's go get a coffee. So we're at the Celebration Town Tavern. The Celebration Diner has opened back up, but they do not allow pets on the patio anymore after an incident they said had happened. But we can't hear. Come on. Isn't she such a good girl? She is. You I met. Oh, yeah, I am. No, I met Gracie for real. Look at she's such a good girl. Is she such a good girl? Oh, there you go. Oh, oh. for you. Oh. All right. You guys need a minute? Take yes, please. Time. Absolutely. Spaghetti. Okay, so the food is here. My mom ordered the tavern burger, which looks pretty dang good. Mm -hmm. I don't like mushrooms, but that burger looks stacked. And then I got the meatloaf stack thingy, and we are for certain splitting some of this there, honey bun. <laughs> I don't know how I'm going to eat this. Oh my gosh. This. So just clean. I should not be. This is so good. Wow. Crazy. Some meatloaf. It's good. She loves it. You like it? More please? All right, mom's first bite. Oh my gosh. You didn't get any of the burger. You just literally bit. Mm -mm. Oh. What do you think? Good. Is it good or is it just... It's really good. We're always honest here on this channel. You know that. Yeah, I know that. So how is it now that you've had a few bites? It's really good. Good, okay, good, I'm glad. Mine is excellent. I love it. Gracie loves it. Let me make sure it's not too hot for her little mouth. Nope. Wait for you to bite. Beep, beep, beep. You're such a good little eater. I love you so much. Gosh, I love you. Final thoughts. It's really good. It's really good, Barbara. You sound like you're crying over it. Oh, sorry. <laughs> it was really good. It was I'm a really sorry. good burger. It's honestly it's changed, changed my life. Gracie? They make my throat. Final <laughs> thoughts? <coughs> Final thoughts? Good. Besides, it's really hot. Mine was really good. The meatloaf was amazing. Okay, so it's called the Downtown Diner. I don't think it was, it was called like the Celebration Diner. Yeah, it was. Or something different. Remember when we took Granny here? Yes. Love this diner. So good. They have the best sausage gravy. Let's cross the street. I hope it's not too hot for your little feet. I should have got you little booties. Crazy. Do you know where we are? Oh, Gracie. Oh. Yeah, come on. Come on, Gracie. Good girl. I got Gracie this little bone that says spoiled on it, but she's not in the mood for it right now. She just wants to go hang out with her friend. Sniffing cream. <laughs> Gracie! Ah! <laughs> go! You're such a good girl! Come on, run by me! Look at the little you! Hey! Are you afraid of the little you? Gracie! Oh! <laughs> Hi! What's she doing? What's she doing? Oh, you're getting filthy! Oh, 
for it. Mom, look at her. <laughs> she's so fast when she's wet and it's We are soaked. I look horrible like a wet noodle. Joey will be so excited there's a charging station here. Oh my god. The dog park has a charging station. Yep. Joey would be thrilled. You give it to her in bites, Mom. Mom, Mom, Mom's letting her goggle the whole thing. Oh my God, you're supposed to blow on it. You suck on a piece and you hand her the piece that you sucked on. Suck on it and then spit it back out. That's how that works. That's what I do with their meatloaf. <laughs> Joey, what happened to the days when you were actually a clean person? Now, there's dish towels back here. <laughs> there's a box of a tissues tissue, from the hospital. From somewhere. <laughs> An empty water bottle wrapper. This is for Michelle. Oh man, we got a two liter bottle of Pepsi. <laughs> you forgot this from last night. Yeah. A one week getaway. Oh yeah, we won. I, I got that one taking the tour. You took that tour? Not yet. Not yet. Oh, Saturday, gosh. I'm off to sleep in. It's the only way I can get a late checkout. I'm charging this car right now. Let's see. Alright. Upcut charge station. How do you get it out? What are you doing? Oh. I'm trying to learn how to do this. Uh huh. Cool. So you open up the. Let me do it for the. For no, my, it might not work. It will work, please. Let me do it. Oh my god. It, watch your butt, Joey, because I'm going to zap. I'm going to zap you with it. Is it working? No. How do you know? Get Joey, mom got pulled away to the side for security because she's carrying around a bottle of shaving cream. <laughs> a bottle of shaving cream. I have no idea. No, don't even think that you're that special. Yeah, she's carrying a bottle of shaving cream, Joey. I don't know. <laughs> Unbelievable. We gotta get out of here. Well, I do love y'all, but I'm gonna go ride some Spaceship Earth while you guys do this. Oh my goodness, it's so beautiful. Look at that monorail. I just sat here and waited for the monorail shot. You don't know what the monorail is? The monorail is the transportation <laughs> system at all Walt Disney World parks. You want to go on a monorail? I don't know what it is. The monorail oh, we'll is take the you transportation. On the monorail, then. Oh, it's over there, or is that the exit? No, the, the monorail is up here. The monorail. No, it's not shake. It's not. A, it's a, one of the best rides. You you know Espanol. Por favor, manténganse alejado de los puertos. Will be in your mind for the rest of your life. Do we have to have mass? Oh. We it's not on anymore, Veronica. It's not. It's not on. No, it's, it's telling you everything right here. <laughs> it charged me a dollar fifty. Let me scare mom with it. Act like oh, you're afraid, free. Joey. Act like you're afraid of me doing this, and then see if she gets. The car started. Ah. What are you talking uh, to Veronica oh. for? The monorail. Who pointed out the monorail? Who got excited more than me? I did. That's right. There should be monorails all across America. Me too. The, I see the, Mom, you're too loud. People wear headphones and watch these things sometimes if they're even still watching. Um, Don't you, a hole in my so face. Joey, listen, I look over, the security guard got a bottle of shaving cream <laughs> in his hands of mom's. <laughs> and she literally was like, oh, I didn't know. She's like, yeah, I think I needed that though. <laughs> Carrying it around with me. All right. Trip. Tonight, we are staying at the Riviera Resort. I'm so excited. Are you excited? Yes, I am, and I'm gonna sit on the balcony and relax. I'm so excited. I'm carrying my bag, my, my suitcase up the wrong way, and I'm dragging it, and I'm going to rip it. There's the Skyliner, and we're eating at Topolino's Terrace tonight. 
I've never done that before. I am really, 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 really excited. Mom does not want to go to Topolino's. Also, I have to find out if there's a wheelchair that we can use to get Michelle up here. <gasps> Look it. How great is that? I mean, come on. And here it is, the beautiful, wonderful Riviera Resort. Not sure where she's going, but I'm just following her. Don't follow me, I'm just looking for the elevators. I am so happy we guessed the right side. You Although did. we are parked on the wrong side. No, we're parked on the wrong side, walked through, and now we're on the right side. Yeah, it's just a right? 8360, what is it? 8360 is eighth floor, right? Oh, right? You're right, actually. Oh boy, we are not doing good. Get it, <laughs> all right. So, okay. Thank you. So I wanted to believe you, because you're my mom, and I'm supposed I to really trust you with all that I've got. But it went. I was right. And I was wrong. And you were wrong. And, and I want so this to go down in history. Down. No, that's not how it goes. And I want this to go down in history. I was wrong. That, for the eight. that is, is very eight? weird that they all start with is, eight because you know what, you're right. Is this the eighth resort? Wow, there's so many more than eight. You got Port Orleans, you got- oh, just for Disney. I'll start counting. All-star movies, all-star music, all-star sports, pop century. Then you got Cornell Springs, Caribbean Beach. You got Port Orleans, you got Port Orleans Riverside and French Quarter. Then you got Contemporary Resort. You got the Polynesian. You got the Grand Floridian. And then you got to keep remembering that there's the Rivi- how many resorts are there? 8360. Oh, where are we going? I'm following oh you God. again. <laughs> and for the first time for me, oh my gosh, my battery's blinking. Okay, and for the first time ever in my life, and my mother's, a lot of firsts for my mom, first time in my life, we are staying at Disney's Riviera Resort, and we're going to dinner tonight at Topolino's. Joey and Michelle and I are, mom is not. This is my first time ever seeing this room. Believe me when I say that. I'm not making up any stories. I didn't shower. I didn't redo my makeup. It's all a figment of your imagination. And ladies and gentlemen, for the first time I've ever seen this room. First time I'm ever seeing this. Wow. Look at this room. So this is where we just walked in, and there's this little stand here, and the recycling and trash bin. And it looks like they forgot a beer can in the recycling. Totally understandable. And then here is a closet. Oh wow! It's actually, it's actually pretty big. It's got a vacuum for your crumbs and stuff, and a nice body-sized mirror so you can check yourself out in the morning. Someone's dirty clothes. Um, the little kitchen area, which is really cute. I set my mask down here and charged my phone. You know, it's my first time ever seeing this room. Then up here we have also a blender. We have a coffee maker, a fridge. What's in the fridge? Oh, I know what's going to be in the fridge. And then... Wow, they sure didn't clean up this room very good, but what can you do? Look at the shower curtain it has little Mickeys on it. Did you notice that? What? The shower curtain has hidden Mickeys on it. Oh, does it? Yeah. This is the get ready area vanity thing. They left me a brush with a bunch of bows, a broken hair dryer, and a pink toothbrush. Very odd. Let's take a look at this tile work. Wow. Okay, so we are in a, is this a deluxe room? Why am I asking her? Shoot, I have no idea. But the shampoo and conditioner are chained to the wall. But this is shower number one. This marble was imported from Italy. You can tell that right there is what gives it away. This resort has two showers. So you kind of, all right, let me give you an idea. You walk in here. And this is also a door to another bathroom where the loo is located. This side 
is the one with the Italian marble with the sink too. This side is the one where you do your business. It comes equipped with Aussie Awesome Volume Shampoo and Conditioner, a waterfall rain head shower, a portable shower for all your needs, or I mean a removable shower head. This shower has a bench for when you're really depressed and you want to put on your emo music from the 2000s and you just kind of want to have the water flowing and think about your life and contemplate everything you've done. This art here, oops, this art here is to make you really think about shrimp. As you can tell. Very nice. I saw this in an exhibit once in North Carolina. True. So you walk into this room. This is the main room. <gasps> She's already one step ahead of us. She's done the three days at Disney people. Oh. Remember? Eric I... Baker. Wait, 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 from wait. Roseville, Georgia. Okay. Nice. Greatest director of Walt Disney's Imagineering. Oh. Wow. Eric Disney Baker. Disney ride is Par Pirates of the Caribbean. Eric Baker. Kudos. Hello, Eric. Number two. All right. Wait, wait, wait. Let me just try to make it random. <gasps> random. Oh, we have Scott Drake. Wow. Marvel, California, USA. Creative executive. <laughs> executive. Marvel Global Portfolio. Walt Disney Imagineering. The Haunted Mansion is his favorite ride. Oh, Scott. Scott. And Drake. number three. Drum roll, please. Woo! Chapter five. No, 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 no. Oh, Jesse. Eric. Oh, oh, oh wait. I'm sorry. I'm looking so at... who is number three? Oh, these guys are Jesse Tyler and Eric Stone Street from uh, Jesse's from Albuquerque, New Mexico, and Mom, Eric there's... is from Kansas City, Kansas. Oh my God! And they are on ABC's Modern Family. They play a uh... bookshot. Oh, slam the bookshot. Okay, thank you. All right. This is an oh mom. Yes, but look at how much. And the frog. Wow, I can't even. And the reason I wanted to stay here the most. Are you mentally prepared? Yes. Also, hit a Mickey on the molding of your headboard, up there in the middle. Oh yes. And Mademoiselle B Mouse poster. But wait a second. Are you ready for this, mom? One hundred and one Dalmatians finally got a place besides all star movies where they got an entire section. What? But look, mom. Yes. <gasps> the puppies. Dalmatians. Oh. You can just see she oh never listens to me. Oh my god, that was Veronica's favorite movie when she was little. You think watch I, the I, I, I? Watch the doggies. I don't think anybody would ever believe you. <laughs> oh, I don't think so either. Do you see how I did that with one arm? To keep you busy for. I actually still watch 101 Dalmatians almost weekly. These are the curtains in here. They have little RRs for Rolls Royce. That's all I think about when I see this resort. All right, how do you get out here? You can see that the Broy Hills in this room are really nice. These are really fancy. This one is the one that they imported from Spain. That came. <sighs> Yes. Christina. This is the one that they imported from Spain. And this one came from Albuquerque, New Mexico. You can tell it's made in America. I can tell by the way that they put these nut heads over here. Very nice. And since I like to only speak the truth here, we got the best view in the house. <laughs> Very nice. No, I'm kidding. It actually isn't horrible. Look at how pretty that is. And I'm blessed. How lucky am I right now? I am in the Riviera Resort. I couldn't be more lucky of a person unless there was a monorail that went this way through here. And if my camera magically lost that little hair. And if Gracie was here with me. Okay, there's a... We're grateful, we're thankful, and we're blessed. Riviera Resort chairs. I'm going to put them in my suitcase. Mom, I want these for the house. Oh, my phone's ringing. Oh. Hello? We're at the main entrance. Did you get your wheelchair from Blaze? No, we thought you would have the wheelchair from Blaze here. Mom, I thought you were going to have the wheelchair well, ready from Blaze. What are we going to do? Ditch Michelle out here to sit on the sidewalk? No, you get out of the car, go inside, you park where the thing is. 
Park or what thing is? All right, Ma. What? I'm going to go up to dinner. All right. I got the goods. All right. Have fun. I might be sleeping. You probably will be. Goodbye. Goodbye. Aren't you worried about me? Yep. I worry about you all the time. Okay, bye. He left her just sitting out here. Are you satisfied with this resort now? You have charging stations. I know we saw them when we were parking. But look at we got you birthday button. 30 years old. But we got celebrating ones. So she's wearing one that says celebrating and I'm wearing one that says celebrating. Your 30th birthday. Mom is not coming. She's reading one day at Disney, eating potato chips, and you know the rest of that. Everybody's getting their masks on. Now it's time to fireworks. Topolino time. Which elevator do you think is closer? These elevators. Because we're dying. all right. They're upset that they didn't dress up. I didn't dress up either. I'm just in a white shirt and nice shirt. Here's the lobby. If you look, they got lots of wine. Muy bonita. Wait, what is this restaurant? Italian? Hmm. And our table is all ready, ready. Into the unknown. So this is the restaurant. You walk in and they got this broom on the ceiling over here in the middle. Oh my goodness, you can see the fireworks. They've caught forever. Oh my gosh, how cute. I get super excited for this kind of stuff. <laughs> I'll let you know they're really great. Do you want to switch sides? We're laughing because our wheelchair has this gigantic pole coming out of it. Like, alert, we want everyone to know that there's a wheelchair over here. <laughs> oh, that would be good for Granny if she just started wandering. Off. Look at that. So here is the little setup area. Well, not the setup area. It's your silverware, your place setting. Here is your place setting. Beautiful. Joey just pushed his right to the side. We have used the wheelchair as our stuff holder. <laughs> I'm pretty excited because this is my first time filming this and my first time actually doing this. So this is the menu. It's like a little wooden menu. Oh, is it very small menu? We have antipasto starters. Handcrafted pasta, seafood and meat. Oh wait, it doesn't turn. This is it, this is the menu. Here we go. Then you got alcohol. Bud Light is from St. Louis, Missouri. I didn't know that. We're trying to Google and see what things mean and Joey goes, what do you mean? I know what all of it means. So I'm trying to ask him, what does beef bargaloo, beef bargaloogie mean? beans, watercress, garden <laughs> radish, and lemon. What more do you want? I want to know what beef bargaloogie really is. Well, there's not many choices. Don't Google it. You have to tell us what it is. Since you're so smart and we're stupid for looking it up. Go ahead. What's Beef's barga Beef's Bargaloogie? It's all on a plate. It's okay. Radish here. Okay. Your lemon meringue is in the middle. Okay. And the white beans all on the side too. And your watercress is in the middle. And that's Beef's Bargaloogie, everybody. You heard it here first. I don't think they yes. were an appetizer. Yes, antipasto means appetizer. So gnocchi is duck confetti with pesto bianco, garden kale, and pine nuts. Pesto bianco, but that remains duck confetti. I ordered the Cronenberg 1664 Lager. It's from France. So what we're trying to do is keep our drinks like you know in the theme of the restaurant, which he said is Italian French. And Topolino means little mouse. And Joey ended up getting a Domaine Dupont Bouche Brut Hard Cider from France. And then we have Michelle going for the Peroni Nastoro Azuro Lager. And I said, what's the lightest beer you got besides Buzz Bud Light? And he said, they're like equal. And I cannot get a Bud Light because this is not a meal for that kind of stuff. We are being fancy tonight. We are in France and we are in Italy all in one meal. We're trying to guess what this little dish is for. I guessed oil, but it can't be oil because there are little holes in the side. It could be an ashtray. No. So since we're in French, um, um, France and Italy all together, 
We are all having a hard time deciding what we want to get because we don't really understand what we're getting. <laughs> so um, I'm gonna get the filet mignon because I know I like that. I think Michelle says she's gonna get rigatoni, which is braised chicken sugo, broccolini rapini, <laughs> wild mushrooms. <laughs> <laughs> this is the Cronenberg. This is the Peroni. And Joey's is actually coming in its own little bottle for little Joey's birthday. Start with the cider from France. Tell me how it is in your own words. Sour. All right, this is my turn in trying the cider, and I'm going to tell you my first thoughts on it. Very bitter. Very bitter. It tastes like an addict. Must be. Michelle? Not a fan um, favorite. Think... All right, moving on. Here is the beer from France. It's the Cronenberg. First thought as soon as you sip it. Turn. I don't love it, but I don't hate it. It's good. It's not bad. Yes. Mm, I like that. Yeah, it's not bad. Mm. Now, that is going to be a baguette style bread for you this evening. We're going to be pairing that up with our Jean Renault full press olive oil. And we get the shit from Provence, France for you. We were right. It's for oil. Uh, yep. We need the oil in our Joey, you're running out. You're going way out of order. All right, the last one is the Peroni from Italy. I got high expectations for this one. All right, you do? Yeah. My favorite. Oh, really? High expectations are paying off. For the Peroni? Light. Very light. Not what I thought it would be. I feel like they taste kind of similar. But what is, no. what is it? What is it? Side by side, <laughs> just to show the color difference. Oh. <laughs> I was upset. He's like, can I have this now? It's the bread, it goes in the oil, and. It's kind of tough, I'm seeing. <laughs> what? <laughs> Hold your horses there, pal. All right, so the ricotta antipasto showed up. It's ricotta cheese and antipasto, all in one. My second favorite cheese is ricotta. Joey just went for it, didn't even give me a dang chance here. How is it? <laughs> You think it's bad? No, it's good. I like it. That's good. Because I love a cop. That's good. At first, I was a little shocked, but no, I love it. It's really good. Topped off with a, a pickled onion. Now, the black things that you're going to see on there, that is going to be a squidding twill. It's just dehydrated squidding. And then the little clear dust that you're going to see on there, that'll be a champagne gel. It's actually very delicious. I have a lot of it on lobster itself. And enjoy. Wow, yours is special. Very fancy. I was like, I don't want to be <laughs> wasabi. I want to know now. Because... So we got the same thing, but this is the filet. Look at that. Give it a good spin. And then we'll give it a good cut. All right, we're in a few bites in, in France and Italy. How's the lobster linguine? It's okay. It's very interesting. She had to tell you to cut your food. It's interesting. Do you like it? Yeah, it's not bad. How do you like your filet? Love it. Amazing. Why does mine look nothing like yours? I am very messy. It's good. All right. Did you like it? Thumbs up. Did you like it? Mm -hmm. One thumbs up. And I love mine. I don't know what that was. I guess an onion. I do avoid all greens, unfortunately, for me. But it was very good. Aw, they brought Joey over a macaroon. Oh, it says happy birthday on the other side. How cute. They gave me two spoons. They gave you two spoons for you and your girlfriend. Muy bonita. <laughs> All right, now we're going to go outside and look at the patio. All right, Michelle, go first. 
show going first. <gasps> they have party lights out here. It's nice. Oh my gosh, it's so cute out here. It was good. It was it was fun. It was an experience. You know, I enjoyed it. I never did it before.